Hi, Bright Play Pals. Thank you so much for clicking on this video today. I'm so excited. We've got something new that we're going to do. We're going to do an unboxing and we're also doing a DIY. So stick around and let me tell you what it's all about. Hey guys! I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. Guys, let me tell you, I'm so excited. Um, this video, I am so pumped for this video. Woo! I'm so happy. Today we're doing something that's going to be really, really fun. I'm so excited. Over the last several months, I have collected um, many, many LOL dolls. And anytime I open one of the surprise balls, there's always a chance that we get a duplicate doll. And that has happened to me. And sometimes it's two of the same doll and sometimes it's even three of the same doll. And the question that I've gotten from you guys is, well, what are you gonna do with those duplicate dolls? You can always give them as gifts to people. That is a great thing to do. Just give it to someone. You can always exchange with someone that collects LOL dolls and maybe they have a doll that you don't and you guys can exchange. They're, and so that could be someone that you actually know. But then also there's online groups like Facebook and things like that where you can do LOL doll exchanges. So you can take your LOL doll and exchange it for another one with someone that you don't know, but still you can be able to exchange those dolls. So that could be fun. And maybe you get to make new friends in the process as well. Now the other thing that you can do is you could sell them online on places like eBay and stuff like that. You can sell your pre-owned open doll to someone and maybe use that money to buy some LOL doll accessories or maybe even another doll. So it really depends. And sometimes when the doll is in high demand, you could really get a good price for it. So that is definitely an option. But today we're going to do something that I think is far more fun and I'm excited about it, is we are going to create a custom LOL doll. Um, this doll is going to be one of a kind because we are going to create her and she is going to be the only one that looks like her. So let me tell you how we're going to do it. The <clears throat> LOL Fashion Crush. Now, LOL Fashion Crush is part of the I Spy series, and inside this little package, we will have in a complete outfit. We're gonna have um, the, the dress or you know top and bottom for the doll, and then we're also going to have some shoes. So, what we're going to do is we're going to open this up, and we're gonna see what's inside, and based on what's inside, we're gonna pick one of our dolls from our duplicate collection and create a custom LOL doll. Let's go ahead and get to this unboxing so we can see what outfit we're going to put on our custom LOL doll. Okay, everyone. So now here's for the exciting part. This is part of the I Spy series. It is the LOL Surprise Fashion Crush. So we're going to go ahead and open this up to see what surprises we have inside so we can know what outfit we're going to put on our custom LOL doll. Now that I was not expecting. This is like a little jelly. It feels like slimy a little bit. Oh, now that is really, really interesting. So if you guys haven't done these fashion crush, that's what it's all about. So that is interesting. Ooh, now this is so cool. Look at this. So we just have to kind of smush this out. You guys, this has the weirdest texture. Um, it's a strange little texture. So it could be a little messy. So um, you might want to consider that when you pull out your outfit. Now, I thought this was going to be something in the athletic club, but I was so wrong. This is someone in the glam club. So we have the dress for our doll that's in the glam club. And we have some cute little shoes. So these shoes right here. Um, that we have you guys I have this jelly stuff everywhere but anyway these are so cute um, I love these I love these shoes look it's got the little strap at the top so um, that is cute so can't wait to see what we're gonna do with that and this outfit that we see right there the outfit is right there is a part of the glam club and it's popular a little bracelet fell out of there I almost missed that so there it is a little bracelet so just be careful with these when you're opening all of this jelly and inside there's like little glitter inside the little jelly thing I don't know if you can see it but there's like little glitter stars and stuff like that so that is super duper fun but um 
I kind of want to smush and play with that some more. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and get cleaned up. And then let's go ahead and talk about our LOL doll that we're going to create. Okay, everyone, now that we have our LOL surprise accessory, I have selected a doll that I want to transform. So we're going to make a custom doll. And this is what she looked like with her original outfit that I um, received. But we are going to transform her into a new LOL doll. So what you're going to need in order to complete this DIY is you are going to need um, nail polish. We're going to use nail polish. We're using the um, Sally Hansen Extreme Wear nail polish. Um, this has some glitter in it. I don't know if you can see that some little glitter flex so we're doing that and then we also have this kind of candy apple red kind of color that we're going to use this insta dry wanted to use some nail polish that would dry pretty quickly also you need a brush um, we will be able to use the nail brush as well but for some of the more detail areas that we need um, we're using a, a pretty small um, paint brush so that's what we're going to do so let's go ahead and get started with this DIY and see what we come up with for our lol doll Okay, so I completed the rest of the paint um, that we put on with the brush and it has dried. It really dried really quickly, so that was really cool. And um, so again, this was the uh, nail color that we used, um, the Sally, Sally Hansen um, Extreme Wear. <clears throat> didn't use this particular red one um, because I just changed my mind so what I did was I colored her hair and as you can see her hair is a nice glittery red and I also gave her some kind of glittery red eyes which were just something different um, to make her look a little different and gave her some red gloves I decided to leave the shoes the way they are and so we're going to go ahead and put her dress on Okay guys, we're all finished here. Um, we've got her dress on, her shoes, and we also have her little bow on. I think she looks adorable. And I think I'm going to call her Candy because I love her kind of candy apple red hair. And I also wanted to give you guys a look at what she looked like originally. The original doll he is right here. It is Curious Cutie. And so she had blonde hair, we turned her red, we kind of changed her eye color. She of course has on a different outfit, um, put her bow on just a little different to give her a kind of a different personality. So guys, there you go. Um, there is the finished product. We have our doll, Candy Cutie, uh, that we did, uh, who is a custom doll from Curious Cutie that we have over there in the blue. You guys let me know what you think about Candy Cutie with her candy apple red hair and her candy apple uh, gloves and her red eyes. She also has like glitter hair, so I think that's really cool. You guys let me know what you think in the comments below. But that's all we had today from Instant Rye Play. But before we go, I just wanted to say, even if you had a hard day, we hope you find some time to play and we will see you next time on Instant Rye Play. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. On a run from my given disaster. Away from the holy mind